Hey folks, um, they just hit me on my TV here so you can hear me a little bit better, but um, this past Wednesday, which leads to yesterday, which leads to the video today, um, on Wednesday I was at work, I uh, saw my friend Yasik, and he mentioned that him and our friend Paul were going to Super Bowl Boulevard in Times Square, which for those of you who don't know, the Super Bowl is Sunday, February 2nd, and Super Bowl Boulevard, what it is, is it's like a long, long thing in Times Square that it's being done because the Super Bowl is being held in MetLife Stadium in New Jersey, home of the New York Jets and New York Giants, <clears throat> the football Giants, not to be confused with the baseball Giants. <clears throat> everything set up and you get these um <coughs> excuse me kind of like badges that say super bowl boulevard on them and you use them to get into the tents and things but we were walking around taking pictures having fun um but to get back to where going he goes we're going friday with time to get to work out of work i was like 2 30 so he's like okay and i was like so i sent our buddy paul a message paul's like yeah sure come with us no problem uh, so him, so Yasek, Paul, myself, what we told people, you know, Fatima and Michelle, we went and had a good time, left, you know, everything, and so they had everything going on, you had people from, like, all over the world there, like, you know, all 50 states, Canada, Europe, pretty much, like, everywhere that could be, afford to be there was there, but for us, you know, who made the trip in for the Super Bowl. Unfortunately, we aren't going to the Super Bowl, but we hadn't, you know, time to go down to Super Bowl Boulevard. The whole trip in and out cost each one of us five bucks, so that was like 20 bucks between the four of us for the train ride, 250 one way, 250 back. But, um, either way, you know, we had fun. Oh. Excuse me there, but um, we had fun, took pictures, you know, I had a thing where you could stand behind, like, mannequins with the uniforms on and pose with them, like, here, like, in the positions they were in, and, um, uh, got to, from the outside of the thing, because there was a really long line where you could wait and take, get your picture taken with the Lombardi Trophy, which is the trophy they give the Super Bowl champion, so we got some pictures of that from outside, um, there's this thing, the toboggan, where you would pay five dollars, get on, go up, and then sit down. It's kind of like a slide that when it goes down, it goes down. And it bumps kind of like you're sliding down a hill of snow. Um, lots of different things. Uh, booth for ESPN and Sports Center. Da -da 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 -da. And my friend Sal did that today and got to meet Stephen A. Smith from Sports Center, which I think was totally cool. Um, Great time, uh, and that's pretty much about it. So, Super Bowl's tomorrow. Uh, Denver Broncos, Seattle Seahawks. I think the uh, Seahawks are going to win it. Not sure by what score, because I feel like it's going to be a very close game. Where it could be separate, won by anywhere from about 3 to 10 points in that span there. So, let's just see what happens and go Seahawks win that Super Bowl and uh, that's about it mm -hmm. for all those of you who missed out on Super Bowl Boulevard New York missed out on fun even though they were in long long lines and lots of stinking people it was still a good time but peace out go Seahawks beat the Broncos pin them down for the count one two three and become the Super Bowl champions and take home the Vince Lombardi Trophy. Peace.